Okay, so in this video, what we are going to do is to compare the advantage in the uh, disadvantage of a uh, cast iron hole of a tank as well as a uh, homogeneous rolled steel hole. So what happened is uh, right now we are in front of this uh, Ram 2 tank. So this Ram 2 tank is based on the US uh, M3 medium tank chassis that was designed in the 1940s as you can see this is a cast uh, solid iron the whole of this tank is made of cast solid iron you will see there's a lot of uneven this is a hole is complex with uneven surfaces and pretty much this is thick uh, more than three inches Look at this side, it's really thick. Okay, the advantage of this uh, cast iron is that it's easy to produce because uh, what happens is you just uh, use a uh, one a mold and then, then you just uh, it with uh, molten iron and uh, the cast is already created the cast hole is easy to produce and it has a very thick uh, hole so why uh, why is it that uh, the later tank was uh, made of homogeneous steel Okay, in order for us to understand, uh, let's take a look on this uh, little Sherman tank that was uh, made of uh, homogeneous uh, steel. So this, uh, the hull of this tank is uh, welded. So they call this the homogeneous rolled steel because what happened is this is a flat sheet of steel and then it goes uh, into a roller that's why they called it homogeneous rolled steel so one of the reason is uh, the reason why uh, the, the letter tank was uh, produced made of homogeneous rolled steel is because the steel becomes uh, stronger as it passes through a roller the microscopic alignment of the steel fully aligned that's why this it makes the steel stronger so that's the advantage of a uh, rolled homogeneous steel so the germans are using a uh, rolled homogeneous steel for their tank that's why they have a, a better armor especially in the earlier part of the war the disadvantage of using a rolled homogeneous steel is uh, takes a lot of work because you need to weld it And now if you are uh, about to produce a uh, thousand of tanks then uh, you need a lot of works to weld this thing of course this is not the only place where you are going to weld <laughs> 